This is my little Gamo brake barrel air rifle. These are becoming more and more popular. Um, and one of the problems is trying to get a sling for one. And what I've decided to do was make my own. Now, the sling itself is just made out of an old tactical gear luggage carrier that I had laying around. But the sling points are the hard part. And what I've done is I've taken the narrow part of the neck of the stock and um, tied it with some 550 cord. And then the real problem is up here on the brake barrel. There's no hard point really for attaching like on a regular rifle. So what I've done is put a prusik knot onto the barrel itself and it works just great. Don't know what a prusik knot is? Well, you're in luck, guys. I'm going to teach you. Now, this is a prusik knot. And historically, what they're used for is climbing up rope. Now, this also is a prusik knot. You can see what I've done here is I've tied one small rope onto a larger rope. Now, prusik knots have the ability of being slid easily, but when you put force on them, like say I was climbing that direction, they don't slide. So you can slide the rope up and then you've got a handhold or a foothold. And they really do come in handy. And I think I may talk about them if you go back and look at the video called On Rope. So what a prosic knot is, is pretty simple. Um, here, let me get both hands free so I can show you how to make one. Now I'm not going to go into great detail on how to make a prosic knot. There's plenty of videos online for that. But I'll just show you very, very simply. What you're doing is you're taking an, a closed rope, a rope that you've tied and made a loop out of, and you're wrapping it around a bigger rope, or in this case, a, a rifle barrel. And you're straddling and then running one, one side into the other, and you're doing it over and over. The hardest part about a prusik, and it's not hard at all, is keeping the loops inside each other. Because if you get them outside of each other, they go kind of kind of crazy. You want to keep the loops looking good. Then you dress it up. And then you got a prusik. And once again, it won't pull that way, but you can very easily slide it. So it's a little rope onto a beer rope. In this case, your rifle barrel is your beer rope. And it's loops inside loops. And that's a prusik.